What's up, everyone? Happy Wednesday. We are over here at the lake in Valley Stream today. Here before the sun. Sun's creeping up from behind the trees. Look how pretty that water is. Look at the reflections. Chilly morning this morning, 57 degrees. The uh, honeymoon is over of uh, warm weather, sunshine, morning riding. But uh, we ride at dawn every day. Every day we ride at dawn. Today is day 121. We are approaching the one-third mark. Coming up soon. And uh, before the end of the week, we will be one-third of the way done with the journey. And uh, it's amazing how quick time passes. So, there's Benny. So, message of the day. We're going to roll a couple things together. Uh, my buddy Sam Smith the other day on this Friday Fire was talking about how when we grow up, uh, we go to school and we learn lessons and then we take a test. Right? And that's how learning works. But then, as we become adults, we get tested every day and that teaches us the lesson. Every day is a test. Every day, stuff in your life is going to go sideways, and you're going to learn from those events and those situations, and you're going to learn your lessons. So the flip, the uh, script gets flipped on us as we transition from school years into um, adult years, and uh, we get tested every day. So um, the idea of that is not to we call it lose our joy over these tests. But to learn from it, we've talked about this a lot. Um, every day when life tests you, um, learn from it. Learn from it. Learn the lesson of the day. But um, we also need to know that these tests are going to come every day, and we should expect them. We shouldn't be surprised by the tests that come into our lives every day. Um, God, I think, basically gives us these tests to make us grow, to see what we can handle, and to see how we respond. Uh, when a situation comes in your life, and you buckle down and you, 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 uh, you know, put your head down and do the work and get through it. Uh, God says, all right, they took that lesson. Uh, they passed that test. Let's give them the next test. Let's, let's take them to the next level. If you can't pass the test of a little resistance, how are you going to pass the test of a lot of resistance? So we need to look at each situation and realize that, um, this test is causing us to grow and we need to get it done and learn the lesson and pass the test so that we can get on to the next level. Um, So many of us, when hard times come, we give up. We throw our hands up in the air. We say, why me? Why is this happening to me? You know, and when you really look around, we're all getting tested at the same time. We're all, uh, we all have struggles and battles in our lives every day. And we get tested every day. And that is just building us up to get to the next level, to get to the next opportunity. Because if we can't handle what we got, how can God give us more? The same as gratitude. If we're not grateful for what we got, how can we get more? You know, if you don't appreciate what you already have, how could you appreciate more? So there's some messages for you. Uh, We're going to take it further in that um, life moves quickly. And sometimes we get caught up in these tests and we don't live life. We're so worried about passing these tests. We're so worried about um, the situations in our lives that we miss things in our lives. We work so hard that we miss the sunrises, right? We work so hard, we get so tired that we miss going outside and seeing the sunrise. We miss going outside, seeing the sunset. We miss uh, watching our kids grow up. We miss, um, you know, our elders getting older and next thing you know, they pass away and we miss spending time with them. Um, So lots of lessons rolled up there in one. Um, Realize that life's a test. Pass the test, work hard, don't get distracted, uh, be grateful, and stop and smell the roses because those tests are going to keep coming. That work is going to still be there. And uh, if you're not enjoying the journey as the tests keep coming, uh, there's no point living. So there's your message of the day. Hope that made some sense to you. Uh, If it did, please like, comment below, and I appreciate all you guys on here. Let's jump into prayers. We got some pretty water to look at. All right. In the name of the Father, Son, Holy Spirit, Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. 
Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Dear God, help us to realize that you are giving us these opportunities and testing us to get to the next level in life, to see how we're going to respond, to see how we're going to react, and uh, help us to react in a, in a proper way, help us to do the right thing, help us to um, spread the love out in the world, help us to stay positive and stay focused, and help us to appreciate everything that you've given us in our lives. We're grateful for all the opportunities and all the people and everything that you provide, um, and help us to stop and smell the roses once in a while and not get so caught up in life. Amen. All right, world. So we got the Antonio's Deli hat on tonight. And uh, today, um, shout out to Antonio and Vito, Carol, and the whole crew over there. Appreciate the swag. Like I always say, if you want me to represent, give me some swag. We'll represent for you. Um, but that's it. So it's a beautiful day coming up. Chilly morning, 57 degrees up here, Long Island, New York. Chilly. And winter's coming. I'm not looking forward to it. But I don't know. I do kind of like the cold, crisp air in the morning. But all right. I want everyone to have a great day. Make sure you follow my group. We ride at Dawn 365 on Facebook. And remember, every day, no matter what happens in life, get up and ride. Put your head on a pillow every night, knowing that you made the world a better place. Fire starts fire. Go inspire someone to be better in your life while you inspire yourself. I don't know. Love you all. God bless. Have a great day. Get it done.